second full day here in Vietnam and our second time having breakfast here. We're braving it out, sitting on the street and about to have some street food. Here's our bon bon hoi. It's a pork noodle soup with vermicelli. Uh, what did you have? I got the whole cold. Is that just soup? Yeah. Is there a noodle inside? It's supposed to come with bread. Oh, it comes with bread. Close. And then we each got a Vietnamese coffee. So we hopped in an Uber and we're on our way to Cholon right now. I'm probably butchering that name. But that's the uh, the Chinatown of uh, Saigon. There's a big Bin Tay market over there. It's supposed to be pretty cool. Uh, they have a lot of retail goods as well as like an open air market, supposedly. Um, just before this, we uh, just went around the corner from our hotel and went to a local noodle place. I had a bunch of different types of soups. Michelle over there, she really likes soups. I do too. And so I had a Bo Ko, I'm probably butchering that name as well. Um, but I had that with a with a Vietnamese French baguette. It was really good. And Michelle had the, uh, what did you have? It was the Bumbo Hue. Um, I'm not a big fan of Bumbo Hue. <laughs> I'm still not. Um, but it's, it's pretty good. Um, it's interesting because you just like sit down on the street and you know you pop a squat and they bring you your food, you eat it and you get the hell out. Uh, it cost us about three and a half dollars when all was said and done. Um, but yeah, so it was pretty adventurous of us. Um, we'll see if it was an adventurous, amazing find or the biggest mistake of our trip so far. We'll let you know tomorrow. So behind me is the Bin Thai Market. And apparently it's been closed for repairs for the past year. 11, 15, 2016. So, oh, we'll just walk around some of the uh, makeshift market that they built up front. If we turn around, you can see the makeshift uh, market they built around here. Just do it. Just do it. There's no better way. It reminds me of... I think it's Dongdaemun in Korea where they have different things like a bunch of different shops where people buy stuff either for their own businesses or for resale this is pretty big though supposed to be uh, different districts some with fabric some for hardware looks like we're getting to the end of the uh, looks like we're getting to the end of the of the market district though. It's a holiday today here in Vietnam and the traffic is crazy. Look at this. Down. We're totally doing this. Ba -ba -da -ba 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 America. We're gonna get the French fries. I am a sauce fiend, and this is amazing. Look at this. All these sauces you can get. Oh my. French fries. Ooh, look at this rice dish. Honey mustard. Chili uh, and garlic. Chili. Uh huh. Chili. Chili. Mayo. Mayo. Ketchup. Ketchup. How's it taste? Honey mustard. I always try it at McDonald's at a different country. Whoa. What? Dark meat. Yeah. Honey shaver. Is that soy sauce on the rice? I think it's um. How would this stuff? Garlic soy sauce. Mm -hmm. Tastes like a dark meat with chicken. That was refreshing, especially the peach tea. We're back at a more touristy area. Definitely like this area better. Streets are wider and more historic sites. Coffee 
is a chain coffee here in Vietnam. You see it everywhere. It's like the Starbucks in Vietnam. Here we are at Turtle Bay. The other day it was raining, so we didn't see anything. But here we go. any turtles it's kind of fun to walk on this people chilling here nice little open park in the city the independence palace passing by the opera house hello tourism land we're walking back from the Opera House all the way to the uh, all the way to the the tall financial building where they have a huge nope it's okay I don't want my shoes shined they're shitty shoes I know it anyways apparently everyone wants to shine my shoes here I'm that kind of guy we're gonna keep walking down looks like they have a lot of cool uh, restaurants and rooftop bars up there and moo beef steak whatever the hell that is and scooters, of course. Okay. What do we have here? We have meat fresh and black ball on the same street. Meat fresh and black we ball. Dessert. Probably needs dessert. There's also a share tea around here, too. I'm going to try a cheese tart. It's like a Don Pop Chinese dessert thing. So I guess you can choose like how done you want it. You can have it like so it's super like clean looking or really caramelized on top. It's a buttery dense crust. Not at all like the Don Tot. Don Tots are known for being tender and flaky. This is more like a cookie. And the cheesecake interior is uh, it's very like there's a lot of air in it, so it's very light. Follow Brian to Icon 68. We're at Beyond 51. I look at this gorgeous view. And now here is the cafe apartment that we went to yesterday. Saigon River. The right of the construction is a little clock tower. It's short. We're all done with our drinks. We're going to head back to our apartment, but first, we're going to a bakery. Here we are, the bakery shop. Whoa! Look at this. Wow, that looks like... Looking at a menu. Brian got a bomb me. 25, 25. Got what we need. Walking back to our apartment now. Two bami. I messed up because I ordered one and it was made with like combination meat, which is like it's like bologna and like you know pre-cut pre stuff. And I wanted the uh, roast pork bami. me. So I got two of them. Before we head back to the apartment, we're going to take a look at this traditional market. Tropical fruits. Ooh, durian smells delicious. Tofu. Little snack store. Ooh, yeah. Sugar cane juice. back at the hotel just took a real nice shower and now I'm gonna go ahead and eat what I got from the market so this is what I got from the market my chicken drumstick and thigh and then the spring roll sauces is for the chicken 
and pickle is also for the chicken. And here's the dip for the spring roll. Look how nice it is. It completely they completely sealed it so it doesn't leak or anything. Awesome. Mukbang time. Thai basil, mm. mint, and shrimp, and vermicelli. Good evening. After an hour nap, we're out again. This is actually my first night out. I didn't go to sleep early because I just couldn't find a gym mat. Look at this. We're inside the bar. Wow. Look at my drink. What's inside? Uh, <laughs> gold rum, English tea, and honey. What are you doing? I'm trying to figure out how to drink it. Ew. Here are the locals. Uh -huh. Hi, Charles. And Chloe. Hi. Were you drunk? Oh, it's just shot. <laughs> Yeah, how much? How much? We're going to dinner now. We're going to this uh, restaurant. That's gonna be completely dark, served by the blind people. Why did I drink? I drink too. You did. I'm just a terrible drinker. Are you still doing this? I'm still doing this. <laughs> Got it. Aww. We're going in. Going into the darkness. Put our back here. Yeah. Okay. The camera. Okay, we're back from the dark and we're gonna now go see what we ate in the darkness. This video from the east. So I did my hair today. 